Ah, at least you got to die at the end of your shift. Anybody in here? Sir, I'm afraid confession time is over for this week. Oh, come on, pick up. I gotta talk to you. It's me, Frank Murphy. I walked in on you when you were sitting on the shitter at the couple's retreat. I remember. You know, this is supposed to be anonymous. Come on, Father. I'm at the end of my rope here. You gotta hear me out. You know, Frank, I'd be more inclined to bend the rules if you ever came to Mass. Okay. I'm sorry about my lack of attendance. But coming to Mass blows my whole Sunday right out of the water. I gotta get up early, shave, pile the family in the car. Then once I get here, I'm kneeling, I'm standing, I'm kneeling, I'm sitting, shaking hands with people I don't care about. And even then it's not over, because then I have to take the whole family out for waffles. Everybody gets waffles, and there's another line. We can make waffles at home, but no! We have to go out where the whole town's getting waffles. I got my wife a waffle iron for our anniversary. She said, what's this for? I said, so I could have my Sundays back. So yeah, I don't go to church, okay? Because I figure I'm not gonna make it to heaven anyways. None of my dreams have come true in this world. Why should the afterlife be any different? But I've had a really bad run lately. Today was my worst day in months. My wife and kids think I'm crazy and I don't know what to do with myself. So you are gonna sit there, listen to what I have to say, clean it up a little bit, break the news to him, and tell him to get off his fat cloud and give this guy a win! Sir, I'm sorry, but we can hear you out here. And God can see you interrupting me, so go fuck yourself! Bless me, Father, for I have sinned. I just told the nun to go fuck herself.